Hello, this is Dave Cameron, and welcome to my podcast. My podcast is valuable to nobody, only for me, just so I can vent. This is my opportunity to vent with my frustrations with youth soccer in America and our U.S. Uh, national teams and the way we develop players, which we don't. We don't identify good players. We just have major issues. So today I'm on Facebook and U.S. Soccer does a promotion, a promotional video of a girl that plays on the U-20. She's the youngest one on the team. She's 17 years old and uh, everything I'm going to say about her, it's not her fault. It's so many people's fault. I mean, they're just, they're showcasing her. And apparently she's pretty good. And in all fairness, I haven't seen her play. But I saw the video of her. And right away, they have her um, passing the ball. And it wasn't like a really, you know, functional practice. It just shows her kicking the ball. And she kicks it with the inside of her foot. It's a very simple ball to hit. And it hits the bottom side of her, of her, of her foot. It's hitting the cleats. And I'm like, so I'm like, first I'm like, oh my gosh. I'm like, serious? I'm like, they're going to show that technique? Uh, or is that really her technique? So I'm like, nah, that, that just has to be, you know, I've, I've goofed around and hit a ball, you know, with bad technique, but anyway, so I watched the rest of the video and it shows her shooting the ball. She totally miss hits the ball. Uh, not hitting it with the lace. It hits it with the inside of their foot. And it goes in. But it wasn't struck well. And then as it, the video is going, I watch the whole thing. And then it shows her passing the ball two more times. And she hits it with the bottom of her cleat again. And, you know, like, you know, you're supposed to strike it with, you know, your for me, your ankle. But she strikes the ball. But it, her foot is curled up. And it's hitting her cleats. And I'm, like, screaming at the computer. I'm, like... Why doesn't someone fix that? I mean, does does the U.S. national team coaches, do you not teach technique? Does it not matter to you? I mean, how do you accept that? How does a coach accept that? So wherever she was developed, whatever club she came from, whoever's been coaching her, shame on you. Shame on the U.S. national team. Do we not have... Tech, tech, technical coaches, I mean, that actually deal with technique, that should not be allowed. A simple ball inside the foot, and she's striking the ball in front of her plant foot. I, that's a pet peeve of mine. I teach kids to strike the ball with their ankle, with their, with their foot locked, so it creates this area that is large and correct that it's the proper technique. So if the ball somehow bounces, it would hit her leg. Now watch her with her technique. Her foot is so high on the ball that I wonder how many times the ball just goes under under her foot. All the time is my guess. But no one's fixing it. And, and U.S. soccer, your videographer that's doing this, you are horrible and you should be fired. Don't show horrible technique. At least save me from watching it. But and you see all these comments on it. Oh, she's gonna be so she's gonna be so amazing for the the, the women's team when she gets to that uh, age. And, and I'm like, you misguided goofballs. You know, I get being, you know what, I need to be more positive. And I I have issues. I get it. But I'm calling the spade a spade. Bad technique. It's someone's fault. She's playing for the, the top team in our country. And our, her technique's horrible. A lot of them, I'm sure, is that way. But can someone do something about it? I don't know what to do about this. And they talk about her getting on the women's uh, national team. You know, she, She's not going to do great for the U.S. Uh, women's national team unless the... U.S. women's national team players, the click allows her to be successful because the women's national team is one big click. It's it's a party of, of who's allowed to be on it. They select the team. The coaching staff doesn't pick that team. 
the women, the players select who they want because there's a lot of players on the women's national team that should be on there that aren't because of the clique. Led, led by, uh, uh, what's her name, Megan Rapone or whatever her flipping name is and, and the, the girl that smiles and gets all the commercial, whatever her name is. And I, I can't remember your names. Your names are, you know, the only re- reason I can remember Rapone's name or whatever, and they don't even deserve to be remembered, is because they have no technique. Well, Meg Rampone, she's actually pretty good. But she does the whole fist in the air stuff, trying to, or taking a knee during the national anthem to, for whatever reason, just cause problems um, or support for the NFL players. But that's a whole nother subject. But it, it's a click. But please, U.S. Soccer, just do us all a favor. Edit those videos where we don't see horrible technique. Don't show their feet striking the ball. Show ab- above the ball so I don't see it. Because it's 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 horrible. And the fact that we don't know this and doesn't bother them blows me away. Is there anyone out there that this bothers them? Or is it just me and I'm just nuts? It's just me. Peace out, my... 59 followers. All right, peace out. The podcast you just heard was published with Anchor. Got something you want to say to the creator of this show? Send them a voice message using the Anchor app, free for iOS and Android.